Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today we are going to do an important topic that is break even point. Very important class for Bank of Maharashtra Journalist Officer exams. So students we are providing the complete coverage of the syllabus with the help of video classes, notes, test series, live sessions and quizzes on bankexamstudy.com. The link to Bank of Maharashtra Journalist Officer course 2022-2023 is available in the description. Please check the course. So students, what is a break even point? What is a break even point? Let me just explain that with the help of an example. Uh, students, before, uh, you know, drawing it. So let me explain this diagram with the help of an example. So students, what is a break even point? Uh, what is a BEP? Break even point is a situation where you make no profit, no loss, no profit, no loss. How much units of products do you need to sell to reach a point where would you make no profit and no loss as a situation where you don't have any money, you don't have any loss, right? So this is a situation. So let me explain the concept with the help of an example. So students, there are two types of cost, fixed cost, there is a fixed cost and then there is a variable cost, fixed cost and variable cost. To start a business, you need to invest in plant, you need to invest in machinery, you need a building, right? If you want to start a factory, these are fixed costs, even if you produce zero even if you sell zero units you need this if you open a warehouse if you, if you open i mean for any business you need to make some fixed expenses even if you make zero sales on the first day of your business you need to make these expenses so these are fixed costs and what is a variable cost so if you are selling let's say t-shirts and for each unit of t-shirts need some cloth okay that is a variable cost for each unit of the product, the additional expenses that you are making for each unit, each additional unit produce is a variable cost. Okay, so these are two types of costs, fixed cost and variable cost. Okay, so to start a business, here goes your fixed cost. This is your fixed cost. It remains same up to uh, up to a level. It remains same after a level. It it hikes up. Okay, so till then we are focusing till here. Okay. So we are focusing till this much production. Okay. And uh, what are variable costs? So to produce each additional unit, these are the variable costs that you are making. Okay, this is the variable cost. So these are the variable. So this is variable cost. And this is fixed cost. So this total, this is total cost. So from there to there, these are the total cost. Okay. Now what is the sales? Sale Now let's see this is sales. This is what this is sales sales ka graph. Okay. This is the point where you make no profit and no loss. This is the point where you make no profit and no loss. This is a break even point. Okay. And this situation this this shaded region this shaded region is profit. This shaded region is profit okay this shaded region is what this is profit and uh, the green shaded region is profit and the red shaded region is loss the red shaded region is what it is loss okay so if somebody if the company is producing these many units these many units right then you know that this is the loss if you're producing these many units you know this is a profit okay so this is a break even point okay this is the break even chart so uh, these are the quantity produced so according to the quantity produced or quantity sold and on the y axis, there is uh, whatever the profit or loss you are making. Okay. So the simple formula to calculate the break even point fixed cost 
डिवाइडेड बाय सेलिंग प्राइस पर यूनिट माइनस वेरिएबल कॉस्ट सो सेलिंग प्राइस पर यूनिट माइनस वेरिएबल कॉस्ट इज कंट्रीब्यूशन मार्जिन पर यूनिट टू कैलकुलेट द ब्रेक एवन पॉइंट यू नीड टू डू द सिंपल फॉर्मूला फिक्स कॉस्ट डिवाइडेड बाय कंट्रीब्यूशन मार्जिन पर यूनिट ओके गिवन सेलिंग प्राइस इज ट्वेंटी रुपी पर यूनिट वेरिएबल कॉस्ट इज सिक्सटीन रुपी पर यूनिट ओके वट इज द कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन सेलिंग प्राइस माइनस वेरिएबल कॉस्ट इज कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन पर यूनिट सो फोर रुपी ट्वेंटी माइनस सिक्सटीन इज फोर रुपी फोर रुपी इज योर आंसर ओके फोर रुपी इज योर आंसर एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कैलकुलेट द ब्रेक इवन पॉइंट हेयर आई मीन फिक्सड कॉस्ट इज नॉट गिवन लेट्स अज्यूम द फिक्सड कॉस्ट इज गिवन एज फोर्टी थाउजेंड so uh, fixed cost is given forty thousand so what is the formula to calculate the break even point fixed cost divided by the contribution okay so fixed cost is forty thousand contribution is four so ten thousand is the break even point so if the contribution is given in per units is if it is given in units you will get the uh, break even point in units if the contribution is given in amount in rupees you will get the uh, break even point in amount okay so that's what you need to consider abc company sells shoes for 450 dollars per unit and the variable cost is 200 dollar per unit the fixed costs are 750 7 50 000 what is the break even point so first of all uh, find out the contribution simple formula to calculate the contribution so you know the formula just pause the video and try to solve the question yourself i guess you can do that it's actually very easy so to find the contribution selling price is uh, 450 dollars uh, the variable cost is 200 dollars so the, what is the contribution the contribution is 250 dollar per unit it is 250 dollar per unit is the contribution okay now you need to find out the break even point so what is the break even point fixed cost the fixed cost divided by the contribution so how much is the fixed cost fixed cost is 7 lakh and 50000 and what is the contribution it's 250 so you can easily find it out the break even point in number of units i mean if the contribution is uh, given in per unit so you will find the break even point in number of units okay this is the 3000 unit is a break even point if you want to find out the break even point in dollars in amount just multiply the break even point 3000 units multiplied by what is the sale uh, sell, selling price per unit 7 450 $4. so how much would be the break even point uh, 13 lakh and 50000 or a million 0.355 uh, 1.355 millions so this is the answer we got the break even point if you want to find out the break even point in values you need to you know put uh, uh, contribution in values if contribution is available per unit you'll get the break even point in units okay let's do the next question very important question total costs are given and level of activity is given first of all um from 52000 units to 86000 units so when the level of activity is 8000 when you produce 8000 units jab aapne 8000 units produce kare and when uh, aapne 16500 units produce kare you are making same fixed uh, cost so the fixed cost fc is the same in all three situations the only difference is the variable cost from 8000 to 16500 for producing 8500 additional units how much extra expenses that you are making how much 86000 minus 52000 it is i guess 34000 right i guess right to produce additional 8500 units you are spending 34000 dollars so what is the variable cost it is 34000 divided by 8500 so what is the variable cost per unit what is the variable cost per unit uh that is uh 34000 divided by 8500 it is 
four dollars is a variable cost per unit you got the variable cost you got the total cost you can easily find out the uh variable cost and that's what uh you can find out the fixed cost that's what we are supposed to find so uh, level of activity is 8000 unit 8000 unit pay variable cost is 4 so 32000 is the variable cost for 8000 units okay so and then what is the total cost total cost is 52000 total we got the total cost we got the variable cost so variable cost plus fixed cost is equal to total cost. Okay. So variable cost is 32,000. Total cost is 52,000. So total cost minus variable cost 52,000 minus 32,000. How much it is? It is 20,000. So 20,000 is the fixed cost. Very easy question. Okay. You are, you are just comparing the level of activities. Next question. Very important question. It's about the margin of safety repeated in multiple exams bar bar repeat hota hai ye question sale is given variable cost is given unit sold is given fixed cost is given we are going to start with the contribution how much is the contribution the sales minus minus variable cost you will get the contribution so sale is 30 variable cost is 10 the contribution you will get 20 per unit is a contribution okay fixed cost is available so if you want to find out the break even point easily you can find it out uh, what is the break even point fixed cost divided by the contribution easy formula okay what is the fixed cost uh, it's ten thousand dollars what is the contribution twenty dollars right 500 units is the break even point actually you sold 750 units and your break even point is 500 units what is the margin of safety so simple margin of safety ka formula margin of safety ka formula margin of safety current sales minus break even point divided by current sales so this is a simple formula to calculate the margin of safety so 750 is a uh, current sales break even point aapka 500 divided by 750 so 250 divided by 750 so one third or 33.33 percent .33%. this is answer easy busy okay b is a correct answer now fixed cost is 10 lakhs or 1 million uh, revenue selling price is given variable cost is given calculate the break even point easy question we have done multiple times you can also do that okay by now you should be able to solve this question is sales is 8.9 variable cost is given as 4.5 contribution how much is contribution it is 4.4 .4, okay so break even point you want to calculate it is fixed cost divided by the contribution okay how much is a fixed cost it is a million or 10 lakhs what is the contribution it is 4.4 .4. so 2,27,272 units this is a break even point this is what this is break even point and now if the annual profit is 2 lakh units annual profit is 2 lakhs uh, annual profit is uh, 2 lakh if what is the annual profit is if 2 lakh units are sold so simply find out the total cost minus uh, total sales minus total cost so jitne ka sale ke usme se cost nikal do you will find it out hai na so simply sales minus variable cost is contribution right and then contribution aapka aa gaya contribution may say if you deduct fixed cost you will find the profit okay so sales minus variable cost we got the contribution as 4.4 .4. the 4.4 .4 hamare paas aa gaya contribution contribution is 4.4 .4. contribution multiplied by unit sold 2 lakh units sold ki hai right uh, it's 8 lakh 80000 i guess yeah 
एनी वेज यू आर सेलिंग लेस देन ब्रेक इवन आपको देख के आइडिया हो गया कि ब्रेक इवन पॉइंट इज टू लैख ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड टू सेवेंटी टू वाइल द सेल इज एक्चुअली टू लैख यूनिट सो लॉस ही हुआ होगा ओके एंड देन फिक्सड कॉस्ट इज टेन लैक्स वाइल यूर कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन इज एट लैख एंड एट्टी थाउजेंड सो यू आर लूजिंग वन पॉइंट टू लाख रुपी और डॉलर वन पॉइंट टू लाख डॉलर दिस इज द लॉस दैट यू आर मेकिंग सो आई मेकिंग दिस मच लॉस एंड दिस इज योर आंसर दिस इज द एग्जाम लेवल क्वेश्चन दिस क्वेश्चन हैव बिन आज इन द प्रीवियस पेपर तो ये बिल्कुल याद रखें ठीक है ऐसे क्वेश्चन पेपर में आ जाते हैं ओके सो स्टूडेंट्स दैट्स ऑल फॉर टुडे बैंक ऑफ महाराष्ट्र जर्नलिस्ट ऑफिसर 2023 ट्वेंटी थ्री कॉस इट्स अवेलेबल ऑन बैंक एग्जाम टुडे डॉट कॉम वी आर प्रोवाइडिंग द कंप्लीट सिलेबस कवरेज विद द हेल्प ऑफ वीडियो क्लासेज नोट्स इन द टेस्ट सीरीज प्रॉपर लाइव सेशन आर देयर क्विजेज आर देयर इफ देर इज एनी डाउट इन योर माइंड दिस इज आर व्हाट्सएप नंबर नाइन जीरो सिक्स सेवन टू जीरो वन ट्रिपल जीरो दिस इज आर पर्सनल व्हाट्सएप नंबर वे यू कैन आस्क योर डाउट्स एंड वी आर गोइंग टू आंसर ऑल योर डाउट्स कभी भी आपके माइंड में कोई भी इशू हो डाउट हो तो आप जरूर अपने डाउट्स पूछ सकते हैं प्लीज आस्क योर डाउट्स ऑल द लिंक्स आर अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन लिंक टू ज्वाइन द कॉर्स इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन लिस्ट ऑफ आर सक्सेसफुल स्टूडेंट्स हु क्रैक द ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू बैक ऑफ महाराष्ट्र एग्जाम आई एम रियली प्राउड ऑफ ऑल दी स्टूडेंट्स ऑल दी स्टूडेंट्स टू का कॉर्सेज इन द पास्ट एंड द क्रैक द रिस्पेक्टिव एग्जाम्स आई एम रियली रियली हैप्पी फॉर दैम If there is any doubt in your mind, please ask your questions, and I'm going to answer all your doubts. Please, 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 please ask your questions. Uh, subscribe the channel and like this video. That's really, really important for us. And that's actually all for today, students. Thank you, and have a very nice day. Bye, bye.